Hello everybody, good afternoon and welcome to the United Stands. I'm live, this is your Manchester United um, watch along uh, for the Manchester Derby. Um, I've got to say straight away, and I want to get it in there, that this is one of the worst United lineups I've ever seen in a Manchester Derby. That doesn't mean we can't win, that doesn't mean we give up, that doesn't mean that we don't have hope. And we've run it back here. Scott McTominay, he's got to use this. Should have passed the fucking Rashford there. Why is he pa why is he not passing there? This is what I mean. This is this you can't coach this. This is what we mean. You with that that clip there is exactly why we're struggling, right? We are number one in the league for winning the ball up. Well, ball back. Hi. You clip that. You fucking clip that and show it to Ricky, right? That's why we're shit. Because we're number one in the league for winning the ball back high up the pitch. So Bruno wins the ball back high up the pitch. Gives it to McTominay. Any other team in the league, Spurs, Liverpool, Villa, Man City, they pass it to Rashford and he gets an easier chance. McTominay fucking runs straight forward and wants to get a shot off when he can't. And we do that all the time. It's not just McTominay. It's Bruno. It's Rashford. It's Anthony. We win the ball back. We get it high up. And some selfish twat doesn't pass and play the simple ball and, and shoots. That's why we're struggling this season. We do have a style of play. And we're winning the ball back high up, but we waste the opportunity. I guarantee you Ten Hag sat there, shaking his head, fuming inside, going, that's the chance to score. And some prat has just fucking tried to shoot himself when the pass is on to Rashford. Protect uh, Maguire and uh, Evans. Look at how many players we've got around them. Look how deep we're playing. Good save, Jut. Oh my God, how have we kept that out? How have we kept that out? Anana. I don't know whether he makes a big save or not. The chat's going OMG. It was ridiculously easy. Look at this. Who's picking up Phil Foden there? That is fucking terrible defending. We're jammy. We're very, really jammy not to be losing here. Who is marking Phil Foden? I mean, Anana's save is weird, actually. But he gets a hand on it to stop Haaland scoring. And then Maguire clears it. But that's jammy, I tell you. We're really lucky there. Shocking defending. And again, not picking up the runners. Not picking up the runners. Uh, Grealish uh, playing mind games with Bruno already. Hope Bruno doesn't get riled and get a card, says Wackass. Yeah, I think Anana, to be fair, doesn't get the, a good hand on it. But then he gets a really good second hand and Haaland unable to tap it into an open net. But... Look, fair play to Anana, well done. But who is picking up Phil Foden there? Let you bend me over. Oh, lovely stuff. Right, what's going on here? VAR. What are we looking at here? Well, it's obviously against United because they're looking at something here. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. Must be looking at a penalty. You can't give a penalty for that. You can't give a penalty for that. Well, he's never getting on it. He's, ne he's never getting on the cross. No, you can't give a penalty for that. You can't give a penalty for that. It's soft, and also he's never going to get on the end of it. You can't give a penalty for that. He's never getting on the end of it. It's The low hits it at the highest point. No, don't get... He, he knows he's not going to give a penalty for that. Surely. You can't give a penalty for that. Oh, he's bloody given it. What a tosser. What an absolute tosser. You can't give a penalty for that. He's never getting it. He's never getting it. You can't give a penalty for that. His mum doesn't do, do his hair because he ain't bloody got any. Th gets Shaves his hair off like a skinhead. He thinks he's fucking Phil Mitchell. Hard man now. Oh, my God. I can't believe it. He's so soft. He's never getting on the end of the ball. He's never getting on the end of the cross. How can you give a penalty for that? How is that a bloody penalty? I just don't get it. I don't get it at all. I cannot... In a, in a game of this magnitude, how? He's never getting on that cross. I mean, he'd, he'd have to be bloody... Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Ridiculous decision. It's so, it's, uh, it's, it's absolutely shocking in a game of this magnitude 
to give a penalty like that. The cross is about five feet above him. He's never getting on the end of that cross. If you if you have it your way, every decision would go United's way, says Brad. Mate, of course I'm going to fucking back Man United. I support Man United. It's a United channel, you bloody dickhead. But that's not a penalty. If I'm watching Liverpool, that's not a penalty. If I'm watching Arsenal, that's not a penalty. The ball is too high. He's never getting on the end of it. You have to take that into account. You have to. Come on, Anana. Bollocks. Bollocks. Absolute joke. Absolute joke. That is a terrible, terrible decision. I mean, it's not even... It's You know what, as well? I can't believe he's looked at that and thought it's a penalty. What a super twat. What an absolute prat. He's literally... All, all Hoyland's, Hoyland's done is put his arm there. There's no power to pull him down. Rodri's gone. I'm not getting on the end of that. Oh. I've played the game. I've bloody played the game. Rodri has seen he's not getting on the end of it because it's too high. So he's gone. Oh. It's a fucking... It's simulation, mate. You're a fucking idiot. Oh. Just don't believe it. We've been absolutely scammed there. Absolute cheating. Never a penalty. Uh, Michael Oliver is the VAR genuine... Is Michael Oliver on VAR? Mr. M Don't tell me Michael Oliver's VAR. He's the fucking referee from the Arsenal game. Uh, Ryan Farrell says Gary Neville goes from saying clear penalty to saying it's soft. Well, Gary Neville's obviously against Ten Hag. I'm not listening to him. So look, people might be loading these shit. But all I'm hearing from people here is that Gary Neville's dead negative about Man United. I mean, he's meant to be a Man United fucking fan. The guy shouldn't even be refereeing. He should be suspended. Go on, Rasmus. He's through one-on-one. -on -one. Take a dive. Oh, he's gone wide. I think he was trying to go down. It would have been a red. He's still got it. Rasmus. Oh, Bruno into the side netting. I'll fucking love it if we equalise against these cheats. I'll bloody love it. Man cheaty. I'll bloody love it if we do this. Oh, Rasmus is in. Look at the pace. Look at the pace. John Stone should be sent off. He gave him a push. VAR, he gives him a push in the back. You can't do that. He pushes him. He bloody pushes him. Watch. Look, he's pulled him there, look. He's pulled him. That's a bloody... Come on, Michael Oliver, do your job. He's put his hand on him and he's pulled him back. Oh, we won't be reviewing that, though, will we? We won't review that, though, will we? Bloody cheats. We may as well be in London, aren't we? We may as well be in bloody London. Bloody cheat. Cheats. I guess we should call every foul that happens five minutes after play, as team. And exactly. Well, look. Rasmus is through one-on-one -on -one there. Stones has put his hand on his shoulder and give him a little bit of that. Premier League are doing anything about Man City's 115 charges. They're giving him points left, right and centre. Do you really think they're going to do anything about 115 charges? Not a chance. Not a chance. I want Ten Hag out. I think that's what it's all about. Oh, McTominay, good shot, good save. It's the first thing he's done in a while, but he did quite well. This is what McTominay can do. Strong. Got the shot oh, straight at the keeper, to be fair. Straight at the keeper. Either side of him, he might score that. I mean, keeper doesn't even do a great job with it, really. But we've got a corner. Let's have a little meet. Hold on a minute. They're on the attack. Bernardo Silva. 2-0. What a save by an honour. Bloody hell. That is a goal save. That's an absolute goal save, that is. How's he kept this out? Bernardo Silva with the cross. Yeah, I mean, Haaland should score, but you've got to give the keeper some credit there. It's a big save. He's, he's, he's made a save for him. Haaland knows he should score that. It's like an open goal, but, he, you know... Credit to the keeper. Mark, if you want to see world-class officiating, watch the Rugby World, Rugby World Cup. I'm going to tweet this. It's 2-0. Oh, fuck off. Fuck off. What is it about our mentality in the second half? What a joke. What an absolute joke. Straight away at the start of the second half. What's going on with this bloody football club? All right, there's been an injustice around the penalty, but mark your fucking players. Where's Johnny Evans and Harry Maguire? Why is Erling Haaland free on the back post? What are you doing? It's like leaving your car with Ronald McDonald. What do you think's going to fucking happen? Mark him up. 
He's just free. There's nobody near him. Look, Maguire, Evans, just leave him. They both leave him. What are they fucking doing? I don't get this. You know what? MUFC used to be our name. You know, proud MUFC. We may as well change it to M-I-L-F, MILF. A former great club that everyone likes to still screw. It's just, I can't believe he's unmarked. I cannot believe he's unmarked. That's a penalty. That is a penalty. Why is that not a penalty then? Why is the Maguire one not a penalty? I, you know, I want consistency. Why is that not a pen on Haaland from Maguire then? This is what I mean. The game's broken. It's absolutely broken. It's, it's way worse than Haaland's. Than Hoyland's. No consistency again. Uh, you know, I'll, I'll call it out when it's against us. That's what I mean. That's ex They've just proven my point. They've literally just proven my point. That's why it shouldn't have been a penalty for Hoyland. Because Hoyland hardly touches Rodri. Maguire's just wrestled Hoyland, Haaland to the floor. No penalty. They're just, they're just not consistent. They're not consistent. And, and, and that's the answer I'm looking for. Because that's why it wasn't a penalty by Rasmus. Because Maguire's just done 10 times worse. And they don't review it for Ollie and losing his job. They're not good enough. It's as simple as that. Marcus Rashford. Oh, no. First of all, is he onside? He's onside. Oh, my God. I mean, he does everything right. He does everything right. He takes, he's in one-on-one, -on -one, takes it on the chest. Second touch, well, does, the second touch should be the goal. I mean, got to score that. Got to score that. Oh, great save by Anana. Great save by Anana. Haaland has, this, look, look at Haaland here. Just runs off Maguire. Great save. Man of the match. To picking them, but they're not good enough. I mean, Rodri there. 3 0. I mean, that, that is incredible. Rodri, unmarked, has a shot. At Erling Haaland picks up the second ball, passes it across the centre of the box. It's 3 0. Where's your fucking win ratio now, Maguire? Come on. Johnny Evans, Matt Harry Maguire. Ericsson, McTominay, yes, we've had a dodgy penalty, but they could have had five or six. You couldn't mark a piece of paper with shitty hands. It's, it's ridiculous. Look, at who's this? Johnny Evans playing everybody on side. What, 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 what's he doing? Rodri shoots. Everyone stands still. Maguire's stood on the bloody penalty box. Watch Maguire here. He's the centre-back. Rodri shoots. He's just standing there. That's where you should be, mate. That's where you should be. Just stand still. You should be on the fucking move. I mean, Johnny Evans should never be playing against um, Harry... Johnny Evans should never be playing up against Sterling Haaland. It's not fair. He's too. He's past it. But, you know, unfortunately, football's quite simple, isn't it? And if you pick Maguire and Evans and McTominay and Lindelof at left back and Eriksen in the midfield you're going to get stuffed. And we've tried to do it against the best team in the world. You know, it's not even...